fired. Hi there folks. So the drone shot you saw in the beginning is from uh, Månafossen here in Norway. It's a very cool place. And uh, I get a lot of questions on where I live. I live on the southwest side of Norway and it has some great epic scenery here. You can check out uh, a vlog I did from uh, the Pulpit Rock. Link here or in the video description. It's one of my favorite vlogs that I did. So Norway is great. So let's do some questions. Romanovsky Spark asks, what do you think about subscribers who visit you at your home? Many YouTubers don't like that. Uh, I, I live uh, pretty far up in the wilderness mountains, so it's not really a problem. There's not many people coming and visiting me. This summer it came maybe a handful of people from uh, other countries who was on vacation in Norway and just decided to stop by and yeah, that's totally cool. No problem. Mike Reinhardt asks, is the no shoes in the studio and the house a Leo thing? A Leo's wife thing or a Norwegian custom? It's actually a pretty Norwegian custom not to have shoes inside. It's probably mainly because the weather is often so bad here that if you go with your shoes out and then go in it looks like shit in the house so yeah and uh, I'm a kind of a neat freak when it comes to the studio so I, d I don't want to have a lot of mess in here you know. Paul Mielke asks, I would love to see some basic tutorials on the channel, like how can I achieve great sound on my amp? I do have a gear playlist uh, how to kind of thing on my YouTube, where I talk about everything from uh, recording guitars and vocals and yeah, just a lot of stuff. And I get a lot of questions on, on how to do this and that. And uh, I have quite a few videos about it, so I'll also link that up in the video description. Satan80 asks, so once again, is it possible to buy your metal covers compilation as CDs? I don't sell physical CDs, I only sell my songs online. Uh, that's because it's a lot of work to print CDs and I, I wouldn't know how to do it. I do everything myself, so if I was to print CDs, I had to sell it and then ship them out to the whole world. That would be a problem. And most people nowadays only use digital, digital anyways. So uh, I'm gonna stick with that. Bruzy asks, my question is, when filming the performance shots for your videos, do you play through the entire track for each shot or do you do just a portion? I play through the whole track with each angle you see in the video. So I, when I'm recording a guitar and have the GoPro here, I'm playing through the whole song and going crazy and then I change it a little bit and then play through. And I do this about uh, 10 to 12 times with all the drums, bass, vocals, guitars and other random stuff. Just because it's a lot easier when I'm uh, editing it afterwards, then I can just put every clip on top of each other and put the main audio down and I just sync everything together. For anyone who want to follow me even more than here on YouTube, I have a Facebook page, a Twitter page, an Instagram page, every page in the world. And there I put out uh, if I have any gigs or there are any special sales on merchandise or just uh, general information. So that's it, just a quick video today. I have a lot of stuff to do. So thanks everyone for watching and if you have any questions just leave them in the comment section and I'll probably answer them in an upcoming video. See you later!